So when we do rate and ratio questions, first of all, you should understand that a ratio, A to B, can be rewritten as a fraction, A over B. Okay, so that is a must to so remember. And then the other thing you need to remember is when we do MC questions in uh, for rate and ratios, we can assign a number, a variable actually, to be one. So in this case, we have AB and AB used twice. So since both of them are appearing two times, I can let any of that variable a or b to equal to one and since we are finding the ratio of a to b because b is at the bottom of the fraction if let if i let that a b to be one then i my answer is actually whatever a is because a over one is equal to a right if i make it over one so it will be much easier in the case of question one that I assign the B to be 1. Okay. So let's pop that off. So let's look at the first question. So let B to be equal to 1. Now what that would mean? 5A plus 2 because it's 2 times 1 equal to 3A plus seven okay and i group the terms together 5a minus 3a is 2a and 7 minus 2 to the other side is 5 and a is therefore 5 over 2 now as i said we want a over b right and a is 2 over 5 and b is what we assigned as 1 and the answer is simply 2 over 5 so the answer is a okay so it's much quicker than uh, doing the proper way uh, you can see number two as well. I'm just going to do it on the same screen. Uh, let y2 equal to 1. So same risk, same uh, rule. So 4 times y is 4 over 4 minus 5x equal to 9. And first, let's multiply this denominator to the other side. So it's 36 minus 45x. Okay. And then we will group the x's together is 48x, 36 minus 4, which is 32, 32 divided by 48 to make x. We can simplify this by the multiple of 16, so it's 2 over 3. So it's 2 over 3 over 1, which is still 2 over 3, therefore the answer is c. So it works for all the cases, even for number three and number four, you can try by yourself.